friends so in this video I am going to unbox this solo Q800 I just purchased it it's a box pack right now let's take a look at the box on the front we have the Zolo logo Zolo Q800 it's a quad core phone and we have the Zolo logo on the side There's some information and on the back we have the features it's a quad core MTK6589 processor phone it has the power VR HGX544 graphics a 4.5 inch QHD IPS display which has 245 pixels per inch and 8 megapixel autofocus rear camera and uh, a feature of this camera is that it has a BSI sensor it also has a front camera of 1 megapixel which records in 720p and the back camera can record in full HD we have 4 GB internal memory here with 1 GB RAM and up to 32 GB expandable memory it has a 3 axis accelerometer, gyroscope, ambient line sensors and all kind of there is even magnetic sensor and of course it supports all the latest uh, it also supports 3G and 2G it is a dual sim phone and supports H HSPA up to 21 Mbps we have we get a massive 2100 mAh battery and it comes with Android 4.1 Jelly Bean preloaded and it's radiation safe it meets the SAR norms so let's open this right so let's open this and here it is, the Solo Q800 this is the phone we'll put this aside and let's first see what else we get here in the back in the box and we have this dual doors over here we get this Solo Q800 quick start guide nice color pictures we have here just the basic stuff like how to put in the battery and all the basic things and we have the data syncing USB cable micro USB cable and this is the massive 2100 mAh lithium polymer battery we will be needing this now so let's open this up This is a lithium polymer battery, 2100 mAh. And let's see what's in the other door. And we have a warranty and safety information and stuff. And of course, this is the charger. USB cable goes in here. And of course, last but not the least, we have the headphones. Let's just open them up and see what kind of headphones we get with this phone. It's nice, we get the in ear kind of headphones. The funny thing about them is that there is no mention of left and right on them. So you we will have to figure it out yourself which one is the left and which one is the right and of course we get the single button over here to receive and in the call I think and they are pretty good the build is not quite up to the mark they feel the uh, plastic feels kind of cheap but they are good alright we get this angular connector over here and there is gold plating on it so I guess alright now let's take a look at the phone so this is it the Solo Q800 it already comes with a screen protector applied on it which is great and of course 
you also get uh, an extra screen protector with it so that's really great nice of lava this is the phone the it has quite premium look i must say for the price it sells it is uh, the build quality is pretty good so let's put the battery in and turn it on right the back cover comes off and of course this is a dual sim phone and of course we have a card slot there for the micro sd card let's put the battery in and let's turn this on and here it is comes up the zolo logo and uh, and on the phone up up top we have the microphone over here microphone grill and on the right side we have the camera one megapixel camera and over here we have some sensors of course the phone has booted up and as we can see at the bottom we get the three capacitive buttons this is the menu this is home and this is back and on the bottom there is nothing on the left hand side we get absolutely nothing again and on the top we get the headphone jack and of course the micro usb port for data syncing and on the back of course is the 8 megapixel camera flanked on the left by the led flash and on the bottom we get the solo logo so let's see english that's right uh, we let me set up my phone. so i got my phone set up here and this is it this is the launcher we get pretty stock stuff by lava so looks pretty vanilla experience we get android 4.1 here jelly bean this is it 4.1.2 stupid android get lost and let's see if we have a software update here and it's up to date screen looks pretty good it's crisp and clear set the auto brightness and let's take a look at the kind of viewing angles we get with this screen they are pretty good even from extreme angles as you can see the colors don't fade and the text is pretty readable even from the extreme angles so it's looking pretty good and this is it this was my solo q800 unboxing hope you all liked it thank you for watching